Well, regulated. What part of your ass is part of a well regulated militia? You don't actually believe this shit. This video is being made by popular request, as we've already debunked some of the biggest central myths regarding the Second Amendment, like the fact that it was only created for muskets. Here, the idea of the gun show loophole. Here, the idea that proposed gun control legislation would curb gun crime. Here, and even this very subject of well-regulated militia versus the rights of private citizens to own arms. Here. There you are. So the point of this video is to specifically provide as much context as possible regarding the rights for private citizens to bear arms. And we're going to keep this short. Rooney, I don't have all day to bark at you, so I'm gonna make this short and sweet. Again, we've previously addressed the idea of the Second Amendment being for a well-regulated militia only. Well-regulated militia, comma, the right of the people. Well-regulated men and organized militia outside of government, the right of the people to keep and bear arms so that they could form a militia. We're done. But it's a moot point if there is more context, if there are some corroborating documents regarding the Second Amendment as it relates to private citizens from the Founding Fathers. Good thing there's plenty, so you don't have to take my word for it. Take a Look, it's in a book, a reading rainbow. The Constitution shall never be construed to prevent the people of the United States who are peaceable citizens from keeping their own arms. The Constitution of most of our states and of the United States assert that all power is inherent in the people, that they may exercise it by themselves, that it is their right and duty to be at all times armed. If the representatives of the people betray their constituents, there is then no recourse left but in the exertion of that original right of self-defense. The laws that forbid the carrying of arms are laws of such a nature. They disarm only those who are neither inclined nor determined to commit crimes. Such laws make things worse for the assaulted and better for the assailants. They serve rather to encourage than to prevent homicides, for an unarmed man may be attacked with greater confidence than an armed man. I ask, sir, what is the militia? It is the whole people. To disarm the people is the best and most effectual way to enslave them. No free man shall ever be debarred the use of arms. And you can find plenty more, quote after quote, of the Founding Fathers expressly outlining that the Second Amendment is meant for the people, because who could form a militia if not the people? That's why they had to be armed. They just fought a tyrannical government. What, you think they wrote this so that the people could petition a tyrannical government to ask them for weapons to fight them? Are you mental? If the Founding Fathers knew that the, kind of, that the kind of lethality that we now have existed or was going to exist in the world, what would have happened to the wording of the Second Amendment? Well, you've got that half right. I never expected you all being so stupid. The beauty of the Second Amendment is that when taken at face value, it's incredibly clear. When you add more context, more historical documents, it becomes even more clear. So despite what clickbait YouTubers may tell you, the Founding Fathers weren't ignorant morons who wrote the Second Amendment with no idea that the world could possibly change. They wrote it expressly for the people because they were brilliant and understood just that. So the only argument left at this point, and granted some leftists make it openly, is that you don't like the Second Amendment and you want to do away with it. That you think we'd be safer and that's the progressive thing to do. At least we're having an honest argument. You want to disarm the populace because you think it's safer. Um, on my side, I'd argue... Subscribe! It's so convenient! You can do it by just clicking a button on this digital witchcraft screen. Everything's more convenient nowadays. You have semi-automatic weapons? This sure beats an outhouse. It flushes. You've got a baby there?